Let's say you want to make a video and share it with a private group of people. You want them to be able to access the video easily, but you also don't want the whole world to be able to find the video or to be able to find it on your YouTube channel. So here is how you do it. You open up a browser tab and you go to youtube.com slash upload and press enter. And this will direct you to a page assuming that you are logged into your YouTube account uh, you should find this page and here on this page you'll simply uh, either click select files and select the file on your computer or you can simply click and drag the file from your computer here and then it will begin the upload process and here you name the video um, testing I'm just gonna make a and the description is whatever whatever you want to type and then scroll down and uh, it's up optional to upload a thumbnail it's optional to put in the playlist of course be careful of putting it an, an unlisted video into a playlist because if it's in a playlist and that playlist has been uh, accessible by other people then this video will also be accessible by other people so if you're making a kind of a private or unlisted video you might not want to put it into a playlist unless you're careful about it these other options are optional and then so let's go to the next step okay monetization I would recommend turning it off so that those who watch your videos don't have to watch ads and then click next this is optional click next this is uh, this should usually turn out fine copyright no issues this was a really short video so they were able to check it quickly but if you have a longer video the copyright might be checking for sometimes even hours but you can still share the video before the copyright thing has been done let's click next and here I think by default now it's unlisted but some people make the mistake of clicking private not a mistake but uh, it's tricky to to make it private because this means to make other people be able to see it you have to have the email addresses of people who have their Google account uh, is associated with the email address you're adding here and so if you don't know which email address they have that's associated with their Google account they they won't be able to see the video so I I always choose unlisted because this means it's easy for the people I share it with to access the video but it's not findable by anybody else and it's not findable on my channel so that's my recommended uh, way of doing it public means anyone can find the video on online or on your channel so unlisted okay and then uh, after that that's that's we're done by the way um, notice that here is a button you can click on it to copy the video link to your clipboard so that makes it easy to paste it uh, in an email or on Facebook or wherever later so I've copied it and I click Save and the video is officially published unlisted and uh, the other way to get the link to the video is simply to go into your YouTube studio uh, which is where you know your your uh, where you upload videos and edit videos and then click on the three dots next to that video and click on get shareable link and that also copies the YouTube um, video URL into your clipboard and this is where you can then paste it into like for example a private Facebook group um, I paste it using command V on the uh, on the keyboard or control V on a Windows and press enter and then within a few seconds uh, for example here in uh, Facebook there should be a yep there you go and people can click on this and be able to watch the unlisted video so I hope this helps let me know if you have any questions below